Hi hey guys! Okay, so I'm doing a tutorial for you guys today, and it's, gonna, it's like this. Um, it's really drastic, and it's something I personally wouldn't wear out, but I think this is really fun, and by the way, I got this out of a 17 magazine, and one look, and so it's not something that I just created, it's something that I found in a magazine and wanted to show you guys. And I did just something like this before on my own. There was like two black lines, like like that. Maybe another one coming out like that, a little space between them. It was so cool. I um, remember that one night I was bored and I just put off my makeup. You see my car? I'm so cool. See that? Look at that. I think the, the star thing, the back of the on was down or something like that. But we're going to get right into this tutorial. And so, first off, you see I have a really light wash. Um, I know, let me show you some nice close up. So, it's like that. And so, I'm going to take really light matte color, any color that will suit your skin tone. The color that I'm using is really good for. My skin tone, if you have skin tone similar to mine, this color would be really good for you as well. Um, it's maybe original palette, so it's nice to put right here. Right beside the silver, right on top. And, oh no! <laughs> oh no, I lost the color! These are the things that I hate most of these palettes, is that the colors fall out really easily. Uh, so... Well, mind you, some people don't have problems with them, but I do. First, I'm going to my eyes. I already did this. What I did was I, take, I took my primary, primary potion and I put some on my lid. On my lid, underneath, and right here. Because we'll be putting a lot of color there, of course. I took my chip nail. Um, I was chipping them during um, school. I was going to repaint them. I am after this video. And what's on them is um, the show must go on. OBI, my new collection. Anyway, so I'm going to take that color, take a brush like this, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply that all over my lid. I'm going to bring the color up. I'm going to take my brow line too. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take an angle brush. And the thing that I'm going to do is set in that color, and I'm going to take it from right here, draw a line. How did I get to see that? So I'm going to over that after as you can see the differences. So now I'm going to take Vainglorious, um, it's from the Venomous Balloons collection, it's just in like a cranberry color, I know this looks a lot like cranberry from MAC, a lot of people said, so you can use that if you have that, or any color that looks similar to this, um, and it doesn't have to be MAC, not at all, so put your angle brush on that, and you're going to so for you do a regular winged liner, it's basically what you're going to do is I'm just going to drag it all the way up higher. Sorry. You really want this line to be dark. Then we're going to be taking the color down after we have our line the way that we want to touch the color. Go so a little bit right here at the end. Very tiny bit of our lid right there. Hardly anything. Let's see. So I'm trying to bring this like quarter halfway of our underneath our eye. Make sure it really gradually goes into it. 
to have like a thick line right here, like the way it is right here. Very thin and make it thicker as you go out. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our angle brush and we're going to bring the color down. Just there's no color on this. We're going to take your color from where we put it and we're just going to bring it down. And let's color at the very tip. A little too much going down. Fix it to the way that you want it to make it the same as your other eye. We're going to go back over that line just to make it darker. We really want this one to be dark. What will really work for this is a really fine angle brush. Like, it's usually dense. Two, and then kind of what you want for this look. That's what I wanted. And so I'm going to go clean off your brush. I'm going to take that light color again, your the color that suits you best. Go back on the brush, and then it's going to go back back right on top the line that you did. Now, if you get fallout from putting that color on, like I just did, go back with oops, your cranberry type color. Or you can really use any color you want, like a blue or black or green. Anything that you have and you can work with. Purple, because this is really purpley. Um, or pink, uh, browns, red. Red would look really nice. Any color that you have, um, just it doesn't have to be the color. We're going to put you have. So now I'm going to take a gel liner, paint liner, and it is true black and coastal scent. I'm going to take that on the brush to the What I'm going to do is I'm going to do tight line and water line. So do that first. Okay, so now you can see that right underneath is a little bit more darker than right here. So what I did was I took my brush, without putting any more product on it, and I just went really, really, just a little bit under my waterline, and just hardly touched my skin. Now I'm just moving back and forth. Just putting some of the color right underneath. Just like a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Okay, and so you should get that. So you want to get your mascara, and I got the NYX Doll Eye Mascara. Curl your lashes. Oh, fucking brush. <laughs> Curl your lashes. And put on some mascara. And then we're going to do some blush. I'm using a blush brush. I'm using the Maybelline Pinch of Pink blush and it's in 20. It's really pink, sparkly. 
Do you really see a spark open your face? Yeah, I'll just find your apples and find a little killer. Now for your lips, we're going to use Be Like I Am Gaga, which looks like this. It's a bubble gum color. And the third gloss. We're going to put on the Viva Glam lip gloss, with wax. Um, and that's the look. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna have a blue more. I'm gonna have a lot more tutorials, a lot like this, more. Um. Different colors of makeup that you wouldn't really wear every single day. So, uh, subscribe, comment, rate, um, request for any videos at all. It doesn't have to be like this. Um, it can be anything at all. And I will see if I can do them. And so, um, have a good day and have a good day or night. And bye, everybody. Bye.